Well, how are we doing out there? I hope you're all absolutely spot on and thank you very much for watching this video. Now, I've been shopping. I've been to Iceland. Come and have a look what I've bought. So this is new, Cathedral City 18 Vintage Cheddar Cheese and Chives, mini quiches from the nation's favourite cheese. And it's a box, 388 grams, serving suggestion. And they were four quid, four pounds. So I've worked out on my calculator. <laughs> the 22 pence each for a mini quiche. So let's get them open and see what we have got. So let's have a look at these. Uh, so yeah, so I'll tell you what we have got. We have got um, no rain today, which is good. Now these have been in my fridge all night because I've, got, I've no room in my freezer. No room in my freezer. I had to put them in my fridge. So I'm hoping that they're defrosted. Yes, they are. So easy. They, they, this is them. Let me get a bit of light for you. This is that. There we go. This is them. They're good for parties, these, aren't they? Coming up to Christmas. Oh, and they're going to be tasty. They've got to be tasty, haven't they? They've got to be. So this is, um, these are the procedures. Now let me put the nutritional information on there. So that is them. So it's 77 calories per mini quiche is sold. That is them. And there are the ingredients, if you'd like to have a look at them. There's a few in bold as well for allergies. We've got milk, wheat, milk, milk, wheat, milk, egg. This is them. Uh, and they, they are, they, they come frozen, but I've had mine in the fridge all night. So they're the cooking instructions, look. Oven from frozen, if they're frozen. 13 minutes, gas seven. Um, and it says defrost from frozen at room temperature. Well, I've had them in the, in, in the fridge, so they're going to be a little bit colder. But I've had them sat on the worktop now for about half an hour. So yeah, so this is them. What does it say on the side? Let's have a little read of this. Cathedral City's award-winning Cornish creamy, Creamery <laughs> uh, only ever uses milk from dedicated West Country farms with over 50 years of cheese-making expertise. We're proud to be the nation's favourite Cathedral City. Well, not seen these before. I can't wait to get into them. To be honest. So this is them. I've got me uh, I've got me air fryer. I've got it set up. Have a look at this. So I've got it set up here, look, in this corner. I normally put my recycling here, but I had to put this here, look. So this is that. Um I did a test run last night. I did a test run last night. I thought I'm gonna have to do a test run. Just to get my head around it, I read all the instructions. What a four. Spent about an hour reading them. Still none the wiser. I, I put chips in, frozen chips. It took me 11, no, was it? Yeah, 11 minutes. They're normally 20 minutes in the, in the in the oven. 11 minutes straight away and they were crisp as well. So it, I'm going to be doing them a lot more food in there. Stay tuned with that one. So let's get into these. So let's try one of these here now. So this is, oh, I think they're still frozen. Well, they can't be, can they? They've been in the fridge all night. No, they're not frozen. So there we are, let me have a little look at that. There we go, this is that. They're not frozen. They're... Oh, God, I can't wait. So before I get into it, I'll serve me a little spiel. <laughs> if you like this kind of content, please give the video a thumbs up. I'm going to be reviewing loads of Coming up to Christmas now, loads of uh, party food. Uh, I've got a few things in that cupboard there I'm going to review um, for Christmas. They only come out at Christmas. <laughs> Without giving anything away. Big plane's just gone over before. Um, and if you've not subscribed, then hit that subscribe button and the bell icon as well. And uh, you'll be informed of every video that I do put on. And keep the comments coming in as well. I like to answer. I like to answer every single comment. Um, yeah, so that's that. So let's get into these. It's gonna go down in a one, isn't it? <laughs> Maybe um, I should have just done, done half. <laughs> Wow, yeah.
Maybe not a good idea to take a full one in. Oh. God, that's quite dry, that. Oh, gonna have to have a cup of tea, get it down. I'll take half of this, this one, I'm gonna... The, the, on, on the initial taste, they're, they're very dry, very dry. So, this is them. So I've had them sat at room temperature for half an hour, I've had them in the fridge. They were frozen, I've had them in the fridge overnight. Um, cheese quiches, they're just, they're quite dry. I'm not getting a strong Cathedral City flavour. I was expecting, the last Cathedral City uh, food I've done, I did them cheese, like cheese bites. God, oh, they were cheesy. They were that cheesy and tangy, and my head was sweating with the cheese. I had half a pack. And my head was totally, it was totally it's drenched off the, the tanginess. I had it like cheese sweats. So I was expecting these to be dead cheesy. And they're not. They're not cheesy. Look, you can see how dry they are, look. Now, that could, that might have been because I've had them in the fridge, but, and then sat on the counter, but that's just defrosting them, isn't it? They were frozen, so. They're very dry. And the, the, the taste of the the cheese isn't very strong. Mmm. A lot of um, pastry. I'm getting more pastry than I am getting the filling. I'm gonna have to try a few more, aren't I? I mean, nothing's taking away the dryness. The dryness is there, on, 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 I've had two now and it's very dry. This is them, look, have a look. Let me get a bit of better light for you, there we go. So they are. They've got like herbs on the top, haven't they? Can't, can't taste them, let's have a look, see what it says again, because I forgot. I've got a brain like, um, I've got a brain like a goldfish. <laughs> No disrespect, goldfish. <laughs> so, of course, what does it say about them? It must say something about them. Uh, oh, chive, cheese and chives. Not getting any of the chive flavour, eh? and the and the cheese is very little. It's very little. It's very little cheese. I reckon. I reckon these will be better warmed up. In fact, shall I put one in the air fryer? I'm going to put one in the air fryer and warm them up. Right. I've just had a. I'll just eat that one. No, I won't. I'll put them in the air fryer. Right. Let's turn this on. Um, so I would imagine that they just go in there, don't they? Let me have a look at the instructions and I'll get back to you. So I, I, I don't know what I don't know what to do these on air crisp or bake, bake roast. I'm not quite sure. So what I've done, I, I don't want to air crisp them. I put them on a bake roast, and it's telling me to shut the door. And there they are in there. Look, I've got two of them. This could be a disaster, but never mind. So let's have a look. So 190, so let's set the, that's, I'll set it to 180, because it says 180 for oven. Um, and I'll do them for, I'll just do them for two minutes for now. Not 15 minutes. It says 12 minutes on the box, but that's from frozen, so. I'm gonna do them for, uh, I'll do them for two minutes and I'll check them. So there we go. Let's have a look at these. So I'll bring you back in two minutes. So I, I, I did them for three minutes at first, and then I, I checked them and they were still cold in the centre, so I did them for another two, so. There we go, that's five minutes now they've had. They're gonna be red hot, aren't they? So let's get these out. Let's try and get them out without burning my hands. So there's one. Let's see if they taste any better warmed up. Do them a bit of justice. I'm trying to do them a bit of justice here. So this is them. So let's try and get this out of here without burning my fingers. That's not too bad. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, that's hot now. So that's five minutes at 180. 
So let's uh, let's try this. I smell the cheese a bit now. Mmm, that's better. Mmm. That's better. I'm getting the tanginess of the cheese now. I wasn't getting it before when it was um when they were cold. And they're not as dry neither. The the, the, the base the base seems to be um well it's still dry but I'm getting more flavour. Definitely better warmed up. Mmm. Oh, that's better. So that's it. I mean, to be honest, they're not they're not great. To be honest, they're not great at all. They're dry. There's not much flavour of the cheese. I hope I haven't had a bad batch, but you know, four quid at end of day. Would I buy them again? I wouldn't buy these again. No. You could probably make your own, couldn't you? I know homemade quiches are fantastic. My mum makes a cracking cheese and onion quiche. I think she puts about four blocks of cheese in it. <laughs> um, so yeah, and they're disappointing. They are disappointing. They're a six out of 10, a six out of 10, and I wouldn't buy them again. So take care, all the best. And I'll catch you on the next one.